All right, guys, good morning from Appalachia. It is our first really cold morning. It got down to about 30 last night. Uh, got down to uh, the low 20s with wind chill. So, just wanted to update you guys on our plan with our three little pygmy goat friends here. Uh, so, this is the first time we put all three goats together. As, as you know, Hank is our buck. Grim is our weather, and his sister Bullseye is the doe. Uh, up and uh, we got Grim and Bullseye first, and uh, really enjoyed them. So we decided to get this little guy, Hank. Hey, buddy. We decided to get him and uh, breed him with breed him with Bullseye. Bullseye didn't seem to put on a lot of weight. Uh, her brother Grim was a lot bigger, and I, they have a little bit of Nigerian dwarf in them. And I'm thinking he just got a little more because we've got Hank who's full pygmy and he's the same size as Bullseye. So um, after watching him for a few months, we think she'll be okay breeding. Um, if anybody knows otherwise, let me know. I know it's, you can't really see how big she is in this video, but we just want to make sure we can safely breed her without um, putting an extreme risk to her health. So uh, yeah, it's the first of November, so we put them all together. Um, in this little fenced in area and you know knowing that it'd be easier for them to stay warm and all that so uh, so yeah um, they're getting along good they all three eat out of the same bowl you know the first time we ever introduced them they head butted each other man look how wide Grim is on the back they got to forage this is Monday morning they got to forage uh, all weekend in the uh, in the yard and eat all these dead leaves and stuff so they're loving it but uh yep they're all three together which i guess would if the breeding successful would give us a baby sometime around what uh may or june of next year or something which is plenty of time you know to get it get everything situated before it starts to get cold again so just updating you guys and uh i haven't seen um, I was told by the guy I, I bought Hank off of that he was ready to breed, was making the signs. Um, I haven't seen him do anything like that. He hasn't. I've heard horror stories about the bucks that, you know, if they see the doe in another fence, they will get out and get to her. They will climb fences. I haven't seen him do anything like that yet. So, kind of interesting. I'll keep you guys posted. But, uh, yeah, we'll see how it goes. Thanks for watching, and uh, I'll see you in the next one. Say bye, Hank. Say bye.